Hi, I opened my copy of uh, Home Designer Pro 2019. I'm going to draw a first floor. And of course, the auto roofs are on. And uh, I'm going to create a uh, second floor, floor, build new floor. And I'm just going to copy what I drew on the first floor. And we'll set the ceiling height for this second floor. I'm going to set it to 96 inches. I'm going to go down to uh, the first floor and do the same thing. Go to edit default settings, floors and rooms, current floor. And it's set to nine feet. I'm going to round it off to 108. <coughs> With auto roofs on, that'll auto correct. If, if auto roofs are off, then you have to manually correct or rebuild roofs again. Anyway, so now we have a two story uh, simple box house. <clears throat> okay, let's put a terrain plane in. All right. I'm going to go back to plan and go to the first floor. Now I'm going to go out here with a railing wall. And create a patio. Now this patio um, Well, all right, let's leave it like that way with a roof over it. I haven't named it yet. So I'd Software doesn't know what it is. I'm going to take these walls and shift select them. That's just left click, select, press the shift key, left click, left click, hold the shift key down to get all three walls. <clears throat> I'm going to go over here and, and uh, go to rail style and turn off the, the uh, balusters. And I'm going to go over here and uh, Select post a beam. <coughs> Excuse me. Turn off uh, half post at wall. Go to newels and balusters and change those to four by fours, 3.5. And I want to get rid of that middle rail. So that's over on rail style. And uh, let's see, no, that's not it. Open. Oh, oh uh, I'm missing a. Oh, here we go. Uncheck the. There we go. Now I just have posts, and I'm going to go one more trip to uh, newels and balusters. <clears throat> set the spacing at 11 feet instead of 96. And now we'll go back to the camera view, and you'll see I've got a potential patio out there. Now what I'm going to do is go to the second floor. and turn the reference display on so I can see the uh, walls below it. That's also the roof plane edges. I'm going to go ahead and extend this out. Extend this out. And you can see the automatic roof fills over the second floor and now I have a covered deck. Now the only reason it has a wood floor is because I haven't given it a name yet. I'm going to tell it to be a porch. Where's porch? There it is. And it should then get a concrete floor and it did. <clears throat> I'm going to raise the, the ground up to uh, just a little bit below zero. I'm going to make this uh, on the structure tab a little bit thicker. Um, yeah, right here. I want that 12 inches just to fill in the gap. Okay, and there's a covered, oh, covered area with a second floor over it. And it should be that simple. Without seeing your plan, I don't know what you did, what you missed or, or did wrong. But see, I just drew the first floor, drew the porch. 
went up here, turned the reference display on, and then drew a second floor over the floor without our roofs on, then uh, it's pretty it's pretty simple and straightforward. If you want to get rid of those side posts on the sides that are kind of redundant, just click on the wall. Go over here to uh, Newels and Balancers and increase the spacing to like 20 feet. They'll get rid of the center posts. The same thing over here. Newels and Balancers, 240, 20 feet. And the only other thing is uh, the edges of, of, for some reason, that they default to uh, drywall. And so uh, you go down here, and again, I'm going to shift select these walls and go to the, I missed it earlier, materials tab, and then uh, click on that, press the shift key and click on that. And we'll change that from drywall to concrete. And it's, now it looks like a concrete slab. Whereas before it was concrete with drywall at the edge, which didn't make any sense. But this is how it should go. And uh, just had to see a copy of your, of your plan to see why it didn't go that way. Okay. And you might can look at the look at what I did and do make sure that you've done all the all the things that I did, and it should turn out uh, like you ex need and want. Anyway, I hope this helps you. Thanks for watching. Adios.